Good morning, students. This video is for class three maths, and today we will start a new exercise that is exercise number twelve point six. Exercise twelve point six. Question number one. In exercise twelve point six, they have given you few word word problem. We will do those word problem one by one. Number one. Mannat purchased the bat for rupees ninety four point fifty paisa and the ball for rupees twenty five rupees fifty paisa from a toy shop. So Mannat is a person who has bought a bat as well as ball, and the cost of the bat is rupees ninety five ninety four point fifty paisa, and the cost of the ball is rupees twenty five point fifty paisa from a toy shop. How much money did he spend? So he has bought a bat and he has bought also bought a ball. So what is the total amount he has spent to buy the bat and the ball? So let us write cost of the bat is equal to rupees ninety four point fifty. Next cost of the ball is equal to rupees. Twenty-five point fifty. So cost of the bat is rupees ninety-four point fifty rupees, and cost of the ball is rupees twenty-five point fifty rupees. So what is the total cost? So the total cost of bat and ball is equal to rupees. Ninety-four point fifty, and here rupees twenty-five point fifty. Add zero five plus five ten zero one in hand. Put the decimal straight away. Five four plus one five five plus five is ten. Zero one in hand. One plus nine is ten. Ten plus two is twelve, and rupees here. Yeah. So what did they ask you? How much money did he spend? Did she spend? Therefore, Mannat spent rupees one hundred twenty to buy both the bat and the. Ball. So I hope all of you have understood this channel. She has bought a bat for rupees this much. She has bought a ball for rupees this much. What is the total amount he has spent? If we add, we will get the answer. I hope all of you have understood. Please copy this down. Next question number two. Question number two. In question number two, they have said, "Mummy gave me rupees fifty, and Daddy gave me rupees twenty-five point fifty paisa. My elder brother gave me rupees fifteen. How much money do I have now?" So mother gave some amount, Daddy also gave some money, brother also gave. So what is the total amount is with me? So let me write. Mummy gave is equal to rupees. How much did mummy give? Mummy has given fifty rupees to me. Fifty. Daddy gave is equal to rupees twenty-five point fifty. So first, as we have done, we are writing the information. Elder brother gave. Rupees fifteen point zero zero. So now, what is the total amount with me? I have to add to get the total amount. So total money with me 
is equal to rupees. First is fifty rupees. Arrange properly. Next is twenty five point two five. Then fifteen rupees. Add. What is the total amount? Five two dot. Five plus five is ten. One in hand. One plus five is six. Six plus two is eight. Eight plus one is nine. So, how much money do I have? Do I have? Therefore, I have rupees ninety point two five all together. So I hope you have understood this channel. So copy this. So. we will do two to sum each day and make sure all of you copy these sums first understand properly and then you can copy so children for today we will keep it in here in the next class we will start with the next number